previously. Yeah, that's what I was thinking, because I was like, look, we only have a quarter tank. Yeah. Uh, and now we only have 33 miles, and it's 15 to get um, Let's take a look. So unless we can, like, unless what oh, I need. So basically, we were stuck on this highway with no service. We were running out of gas. We could only see anywhere from 10 to 20 feet in front of us because we were literally in the clouds. Because I was focusing on driving, I didn't film this part, but after coasting for a while, we found a gas station about 25 miles That's away. Sick. Oh, thank you. So we made it to the gas station, and we're filling up gas now. Yay! Um, yeah, so we are setting up base camp once again. There's guys. Yay. Let's go! <laughs> Night two. Night two. Night two. Um, yeah, it's like 10.03, so we're gonna go to bed soon. And quiet hours are in 57 minutes. <laughs> quiet hours? <laughs> quiet hours. After that is whisper yeah, only. Yeah, quiet hours. <laughs> whisper <laughs> only at 11. <laughs> Alright. Good morning. Good morning. This is the last hey. day of the of sleeping in the car. How really is your hacked car sleeping though? I feel like we've come a long way. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I got a solid some hours. <laughs> yeah, Kara's got good hours of sleep. Yeah. Young also got good hours of sleep. Raiden, <laughs> sleep before the week. <laughs> What's the plan? Food. Food. Drive 15 minutes. To the cafe. Mm -hmm. Get some. Food. Get some good pancakes. Not bad pancakes. traveled a couple hours to a place called South Point. All right, we are now at South Point? South Point. South Point. The southernmost point of the state. Oh my god. I decided that I was gonna just do a flip on the first try. To be fair, I didn't warm up or anything and we were kind of crunched for time. We had about 15 minutes there to make it back to the airport on time. So... Yeah, that kind of hurt. A little bit more my ego than anything else because we didn't have enough time for me to jump again. But on the bright side, we were on time to head back to the airport. Until... This is a big conundrum. This is the definition of a blunder. <laughs> Alright, so basically, power line went out, and it's five hours to get around the other way. And our flight leaves in like two or yeah. two hours. Yeah. And the thing is, like, we have to return the car as well. And which the line is, is definitely forming. That way, and. We also don't know if we can park here tonight. Oh, there it is. Wait, there's definitely enough room for a car. Alright, guys. We're here at the crime scene. We almost died. <laughs> so close to dying. But we made it Look out. over there. That massive it's pole almost hit us. Ran. Yeah, we ran. And, like, it like cut off some of the hair. But I mean the hair. Alright, so this might be a little bit hard to understand, but I'm going to try my best to explain it. There's, there's only two roads that lead from Kona to Hilo. We, our flight was in Kona. And the only reason why we couldn't fly out from Hilo is because we needed to return the car at Kona. And our flight was in about an hour, but it took us five more hours to go all the way back around the other way. Because essentially we had to drive all the way back to Hilo and take the other road all the way back to Kona. So after discussing what we were going to do, we felt our only option was to just stay another night on the island. Do you think we drive around? I think we drive around. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. Cool. That's okay. good. That's not that bad. Operation. We just drive around the island. Oh yeah, you want You literally asked for an operation. No, it's an operation. <laughs> and I asked for an extra day here, so uh, we, we all got what we wanted. <laughs> Needless to say, this last night on the island was pretty awesome. I specifically requested <laughs> that we will have, have all these special memories and moments that we wouldn't have had if we had gone home on time. We're back at the booge bar. <laughs> the Overall, bar. something that I took away from this trip. I feel like I'm doing a school project, but. This is dead ass how I feel. And just learn that in life, things don't ever really go according to plan. And sometimes the moments that don't go to plan are some of the best moments. Oh, the car is so warm. Jesus Christ. 
drive like what, 30 miles? It's our bonus night. 30 miles? Bonus. Wait, how many miles? We only have 53 left. <laughs> <laughs> we're driving 53 miles. Boys. The thing is, boys. We, were, we were at a gas station too. <laughs> yeah, I know. Wait, 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 I don't know why we didn't fill gas. Because we didn't have air. Uh, and purchasing gas was our only leverage. Okay. Uh, Alright, let's go. Okay. They're here, aren't we? What a darling. <laughs> <laughs> Bonus night. Bonus night. Because of the traffic jam. I should get one free. Alright. Hi, vlog. We made it finally all the way back to Kona. Yay! Basically, we drove from the North Shore down to Kona and then to Hilo and then all the way back to Kona. We did a long day of driving. Full circle. Alright, so that concludes the video. After that, we just returned the car, went home, and I was pretty tired, so I didn't really film too much. I'm still trying to get used to pulling out the camera all the time and filming. And yeah, just really being on this platform again, because I because I really enjoy making these videos and filming them, and, and I just like to see how much I improve over time. And yeah, so just remember to like, comment, and subscribe, hit the subscriber icon. If you want to see more content similar to this, I got uh, like a month left here in Hawaii and so I'm going to be filming a bunch of content here before I go up to Los Angeles and then finally be able to start the next chapter of my life. Yeah, before all that happens, stay tuned. I'll see you guys in the next one. Shoots.